I bought a very special copy of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, which was bought for me by my father on A-level results day, the day that I locked in coming to Lancaster. It was a book that I studied at A-level and made me realise that 100% I couldn't do anything other than English literature at uni. The prop that I brought was my Tempest A-level book that I used when I was in college. I'd been through a lot at college and this was kind of the text that pulled me through it and I continued to study it even now into my third year at university. It's by my colleague Jen Ashworth who's a professor of creative writing in the department and the reason I have it here today is that it expresses a sense uh, of the new, the radically new, something of the moment. I think we have a strong sense both of a tradition but also of an experimental body of work that's emerging in the here and now. We look back to an ancient past. We're also talking about contemporary literature and literature in the world. The department treats English literature and creative writing as equal and very much related disciplines in the academic world. It's a very much 50-50, very much equal, collaborative department and that was really exciting to me. What you do in this course is you cover a wide range of theories and critics that you may have touched on at A-level, uh, perhaps like Marxist or feminist theory, and you really get to delve deep into them and some of them you might not like, some of them might not interest you, but through that you get to pick the ones that do and that goes on to influence your work throughout second and third year and even into postgraduate level. The English department at Lancaster is continually dedicated to expanding the horizons of what literature we should be reading and writing about. Even in my time there has been every year an increasing amount of access to post-colonial literatures and queer theory um, and that has been incredibly exciting to be a part of. We help students reach their full potential in a variety of different ways. One thing I really want to emphasise is it's a collaborative process. So small group teaching, for example, with a tutor and a number of students discussing a text. One-to-one -one meetings with tutors, lecturers in the department, talking about the students' ideas. The staff in my department, in the English department, is so friendly and so welcoming that you never feel intimidated, even though you're being taught by some of the world's leading academics. They want to have a conversation with you and they learn from you as much as you learn from them and it is a real community driven department and I love it. I think it's brought out all of the best qualities in me, often the qualities that were kind of not appreciated in high school and I think that's the most incredible thing about university is that suddenly you're surrounded by people who will get excited by the same things and want to know about the same things as you 